the upfront for us was an exciting time for Caden in one to one. I think a um, couple key themes came out of that. First and foremost is TV works. It's still a very viable advertising medium for advertisers, and I think everybody recognizes that. But just to put a, a stamp on it, to say that with all that's happened in the marketplace and the changes uh, over the last couple of years, TV still is a dominant medium for brand advertising and will continue to be so. That's one. I think the other uh, key message that came out of that is the use uh, and influx of data is forcing evolution and change within our industry. Facebook, uh, Google certainly have some of the best data in the space. Um, but data isn't what drives brand, brand engagement. TV does. TV drives engagement. And I think the industry in general, certainly from Caden and One to One's perspective, the influx and use of the appropriate data into television is where the market's going. And then the last piece, I think, um, a big message for us is that you know, we're changing an industry. And there's, no, there's, there's nothing that's perfect about changing the industry. But one thing is an absolute is that we're going to have to do it uh, as a group or in collaboration together. And that's programmers, advertisers, technology and platform companies like Caden and One to One, that the evolution is going to take time. It's going to have some bumps in the road. But I think if we keep true to the value of television, what it means for our advertisers and for our clients, and find ways to take advantage of what technology and data offers, is that we've got a bright future. No one in the industry questions the value of addressability, the application of data to bring digital-like capabilities of ROI and performance and return on ad sales to television. I think everybody wants it. The challenge that we've encountered, the industry has been encountered, is how do you actually make it easier or simplify that process to execute addressable television across a national footprint? And I think over the past few years, you've seen success across some of our pay TV operator suppliers like AT&T, Dish, Comcast, and others to show the value of addressability and to work through the mechanics of how it works. One-to-one -one success has been, however, is to not work with any one independent in, uh, pay TV operator. It's to actually bring together all of them as a national footprint. Because if you're an advertiser or an agency, you need that incremental reach. And that, I think, in the simplification of that process, how do you work across all the pay TV operators, inclusive other platforms like OTT and mobile, how do you bring together an end-to-end -end solution for an advertiser to actually identify and reach that audience with the right frequency in a way that actually delivers those results. And the, uh, our, the past year, we've been working with one-to-one, -one, it's been about a year, just at our anniversary. We've invested tremendously in technology and workflow. It's exactly what we did with Caden over the past three to four years, where we've brought scale and stability and ease and transparency to an unwired base of inventory. We're doing the same kind of practices and workflows to the addressable. And we're real excited because across all of our customers, all 300 of them across Caden and one to one we're seeing a lot of demand for how do you actually simplify and bring this kind of capability to their portfolio of advertising solutions. Where do you hope we'll be at the uh, upfront next year, a year out from now? How do you see your business changing or the industry changing? Uh, I think there will be two big steps forward for us as a marketplace. One is I do believe the trend um, the evolution and the, the recent announcements around indexed television using uh, data to identify specific audiences on traditional TV, uh, as evidenced by um, OpenAP and some of the recent announcements there, plus our evolution into that space. I do think data-driven television will continue to be a, a much bigger play for next year, a percentage of the media buy for the upfront. And I also believe a, a corollary to that is so will addressable. We have knowledge and capabilities to essentially put dollars to work over a long, over three, six, 12 month uh, campaigns like we do in upfronts. So the, the evolution of addressable will follow the same evolution that I think Advanced TV has, which is two years ago they dabbled with it. This year it's gonna be a significant part of the upfront, at least the upfront discussion. Whereas next year I think there'll be a, a larger percent of a transaction uh, in the upfront for Advanced TV. Addressable we expect to be the same thing for next year.